And then do you work with international investors? Yes, I work with international investors. Like I just said at the beginning of the session, I said I was just talking to somebody that was in France, Canada. We have a couple of people from Canada. And, uh, and then also students, if you're international, if you want to be a student, we have students that are international as well too. One student is from Jamaica. Uh, he's American, but he's living in, he's living in Jamaica. And he's been, he has bought three storage facilities in the last year from Jamaica, from Jamaica. All right. So uh, you could totally be virtual. I didn't put that on the thing. But like what I'm pointing out with the software is that you want to be virtual. I live in an RV and travel full time and we manage 11 storage facilities from our RV because we have utilized the software. We utilize the software that we have and make everything completely virtual. And it's really, honestly, I think about this all the time, but like my lifestyle is really just a choice. It's a choice. I mean, anybody could really do that. You could choose to become virtual if you want to. And travel and do whatever you want and you know it's just a choice so um yeah and and, it's, and choosing to manage your storage facility virtually is a choice and it's just kind of a it's a new concept so a lot of people really have a hard time struggling with it but the truth is is that it's a virtual world now you might as well just grab it by its horns and then just like take it for a ride 